What a disability carrier is likely to do with social media posts of you token, smoking, and injecting? Well, I think you already know the answer to that question. Uh, if you are doing something you are not supposed to be doing that contradicts your medical records, contradicts what you're telling a disability carrier on the activity of daily living for them, they're going to seize on it. And the worse, the better for them. Now, if your doctor is giving you a prescription for recreational marijuana or medicinal marijuana, you know, that's one thing. But if you're out there doing drugs they shouldn't be doing, that's going to be a problem. It's going to be a problem from a couple standpoints. One is a disability carrier is asking you what you do, and they may be asking you about the medication or substance that you're taking. And if you're not telling the truth, they're going to be wondering what else you're not telling them the truth about. The second problem with this is your medical records may not reflect what it is you're doing. And your physician needs to know, not only for your safety, but uh, for their licensure. Uh, they don't want to lose your license by giving you medication that may contradict you know, what it is you should be taking based on your recreational or other uses of, uh, of other substances. Uh, the third thing, of course, is that the doctor is being asked questions about your functionality based on your report of your symptoms and your activities. And if you're not telling the doctor the truth, particularly about you know that type of, of uh, drug use, then the doctor may say, look, I'm not putting my reputation on the line. I'm not going to treat you anymore. Go find another doctor. I don't need all these problems. By the way, I'm not going to fill out any forms. So, you know, the bottom line is you should not be, you know, doing this. The second bottom line is that if you're doing it, you need to be honest. You know, you may have a drug or substance abuse issue. And there's nothing wrong with that. But lying, hiding, denying is not going to help your ERISA disability claim. If you have any questions about your rights to ERISA disability benefits, if your claim has been denied or terminated, please give me a call at 727-894-3188 for a complimentary consultation. We'll see what we can do to help you. And I may have to say to you, I can't help you, but you need to know the answer to that. 727-894-3188.